Good morning, everyone. Today is the first day of my master's. I'm going to fashion school in London today, starting today. I am so, so excited. But first, let me introduce myself. My name is Izzy Biscus. Happy that you are here because this is gonna be such an amazing fun vlog today is my first day of fashion school here in London I am going to my orientation slash induction week for my master's entrepreneurship in the fashion and creative industry. Sophie is coming over, one of my girlfriends. She is also going to Condé Nast for two years for her bachelor's. We are walking to school together and we're gonna go take our first day of school pictures. We have our outfits on, we have everything ready. So excited. She is not here yet. I'm waiting for her to call me on the street. That's how we do things here at my flat. Um, we're really close to street level, so they just give a little yell and I'll run down and let them in. Let's look at the outfit because of course it is our first day at fashion school. We're gonna go run and get her right now. Okay, Sophie's here. Hey, Izzy's vlog. <laughs> first day of fashion school in London. <laughs> Let's do outfits. So yeah, outfit. I'm gonna go get my. Hey guys. Nice. Oh, oh nice. Yeah. You look very Matilda. That's what I was going for. I love that we were like, yeah. I'm wearing like this long sleeve t-shirt because I get really cold. I put these dress pants on from Zara. I wasn't like wearing anything designer today. I'm just like keeping it like. I feel like a lot of people in the first year are like, oh my gosh, like. Designer, designer. Yeah, they want to like do it all the first day, especially because yeah. it's fashion school, but also like that's not all that fashion's about, you know? I have these like vegan, like low top Uggs. <laughs> Wait, sorry, I just interrupt you. Yeah. I really want to go to Ole and Hansen. Did you go to prep today? Yeah. This morning I woke okay. up at 8. Oh, and Steam, I mean. Yeah, the coffee shop. Yeah, that's fine. But I like literally woke up at 8, I love put that. on random clothes, did not even brush my teeth, brush my hair. Just went down. I ran to the press. See, that's so good. It's like right there. Yeah, but like still. People, <laughs> if someone ran into me who I knew, they'd be like, what in the head? Like, okay. Oh, yeah. That's my yeah. Sure fashion's <laughs> exactly. And I have like my big t shirt on and I like that. all this. Black tube dress, black blazer. And then this lovely little scarf that I'll probably just keep right here. It's just kind of the style right I now. Love the dress, like the bottom too. The, the bottom, like the little hem. Really and then I have these shoes on Nordstrom, but they're like these little pointed. They kind of look like elf shoes, what my little sister calls them. Oh, but they're, I think they're in. So right. <laughs> we are ready to go. We're actually gonna go out and take some pictures and stuff. Yeah. Mom, don't worry. There's photos coming your way. <laughs> <laughs> they're giving us lunch. Oh, yeah. I'm vegan. Do oh, I don't know. It was fall for a little bit here in London, like two days. Yeah, and then now days. it's winter. Literally. <laughs> it is freezing I was outside. just telling Izzy, like, I need to start wearing gloves already. Yeah, it's really cold. We made a pit stop and got Sophie hot chocolate. Yeah. Now we Back are. To the outfit. Yes, exactly. <laughs> now we are on our way to the college. <laughs> We're introducing everyone now to the vlog. But <laughs> Sophie and I were taking pictures, but we're all gonna be soon. Yeah. I don't wanna go home right now. And all I could taste is this moment. And all I can breathe is. I'm gonna talk to our Aussie friend, <laughs> Jasmine. <laughs> I know I'm vlogging. I'm vlogging. Hi, but they gave us like bare minerals makeup. No, like, no makeup. Everywhere. Take my money. <laughs> so how do you feel so far about I your first I feel day? excited. Yes, excited. I feel happy to have my friends. <laughs> so many people we're meeting. We are waiting for everyone. Here's Chloe too. I'm feeling great, excited, nervous. Um, yeah. 
all of it, all, every emotion. How are you feeling? Very excited. Very really excited. Yeah. We did our passport, all that stuff, and so we're waiting here now for, I think, our first speaker. Yeah. Yeah, first speaker, and then we'll start the whole day. How are you feeling, Chloe? We're, we're feeling really excited. Yeah, exactly. I can only believe we're here finally. I know, I know. I'm We've been like planning this for a year, so. Yes, exactly. Look, look at this. Easy. <laughs> okay. Ciao <laughs> tutti. Hey everyone. <laughs> What's up? We should just keep passing it down the line. This is from a British designer. They are only in like quite small boutiques, but you can find them online. so far. I have my pet right here. Everyone's out here talking and chit-chatting and getting to know each other, looking at their outfits. It's so lovely and fun. And so I'm right here doing a little monologue to talk to y'all. We are in our lunch break and then we have a full on day of different guest speakers. We have different things we're gonna go be going through to start the semester off right. We made it to fashion school in London. <laughs> I'm so excited. Little Izzy would be so proud. That's what I'm excited about. home what a whirlwind of a day I am so excited I cannot explain the passion the creativity that is thrumming through me I just am so inspired we got to listen someone who's been in the Vogue industry who's been working for Vogue magazines for many many years and she's the creative art director so she's worked on many of the Vogues all across the world from the staff that's there at Condé Nast. Incredible. The work experience and the connections that they have are amazing. And I can full heartedly say I am so excited for this year at my master's. I am so giddy right now. As you can tell, I'm like blushing as if I just went on a date or something. <laughs> um, I just am so happy. I can't believe how happy I am, how amazing the first day went. Also, they give us so many things to strive for and apply for. For instance, they have student jobs and student roles that you can actually apply for. And they are, for example, there's this role that I really want. The title of it is a host. And so you help Miss Zoe. She has so much experience in the fashion industry and the connections. And apparently her black book in the London fashion industry is unbeatable. You just get to be the first face that these people get to see coming in, which also gives you a lot of amazing network opportunity to continue to be a face and work hard for that role. And it's not even that, like you get to put the pictures and the little summary together to send out to all the students on who this guest speaker is gonna be. Just amazing roles like that, that get you into the industry, get you to come out of your comfort zone and be an amazing person fashion wise, speaking wise, just be more confident all around. And I cannot wait to apply for these roles. I am so excited because everyone is so eager to apply to these roles. Once they started talking about all the roles, everyone was so keen to apply for them. So grateful for all this competition because if you get it, it's even more of an accomplishment because of how many people, amazing people, who are the best of the best who got into this master program, you're applying for something that so many other people are applying for. And you know, if you get it, that's amazing. Get as much industry experience as I can, even though it makes me so uncomfortable and I second guess myself, can I do that? Can I be that journalistic person who can navigate an interview, keep the familiarity, keep the persona of being a great moderator. And I believe I can. I always, I really believe in myself. I have a lot of confidence in that. And I feel like I have a lot of experience in that field, in, in that realm. So I'm really excited, but it was an amazing day. We started in the morning, we submitted, we gave our passports. They did little things like that, um, got us 
technically all enrolled and then we had what the Condé Nast College is about, the environment, how they see students and just the whole realm of what Condé Nast is, what they expect us to be as students and just an amazing environment. And then we had a lunch break to where we could talk to more people. I met so many wonderful, amazing people. And I was also nervous about that of, you know, people coming in and just being, they think they're everything and so rude to people that they don't even have to be nice to people. But I have not found that at all yet. Every single person I've met has been so sweet and so genuine and really there for the right reasons. I feel like I'm there for the right reasons. We're all there for the right reasons. After lunch, we had that guest speaker learn about different famous photographers and creative directors in the space. Now I want to go through this bag that they gave me. We got a little tote bag and I haven't gone through everything that is in here. So let's go through that real quick. 1999, hey, that's my birth year. And it is a color pencil. We got a Condé Nast pop socket. It Cosmetics Brow Power. It's a universal brow pencil. Also got Bare Minerals Lash Topia, which is mega volume mineral based mascara. And then we also got Paula's Choice, which is an exfoliate, a GQ magazine with a Jacob Alordi as the person on the cover. Such a cutie. We love an Australian man. <laughs> he's so handsome. I think he's so handsome but really cool GQ magazine. And that's all, that's what we got in the little baggie of goodies. Can't wait to try out these products too. I just can't believe I'm here. I'm so excited to sit down and journal this to write down more of my dreams and my goals. They were just so emphasized today and I think that's what this is all about, is to get involved in this industry, really push exactly what needs to be pushed inside me with my passions, my dreams, my hopes. And I'm so excited because I believe that I have an extreme amount of potential and I'm super confident in myself that I know I will achieve these things that are going through my head and all these dreams and hopes that are pushing through. I know I'm going to achieve these things if it's first of all meant to be and second of all, if I just keep my head down and I work really hard, I continue to be a very genuine, down to earth person, work on myself realize that failures they're not technically failures but they are just the path to your successes so just keeping all these mindsets so thrilled to have the opportunity to be in this master program that completely showed it today i can't wait to call my mom in about like a minute thank you for following along i really hope you enjoyed viewing my first day of fashion school here in london Guys, I am so excited. I can't wait to share, continue to share this journey with you. I have to be honest, it's going to be a lot of hard work. There's gonna be so many difficulties, it's going to be super hard, but it's going to all be so worth it. And I can't wait to push myself past boundaries that I've set for myself and to just keep pushing them, keep going out of my comfort zone, continue to push the potential of who I can be as a human being and as a leader and as a successful overall woman. So I'm so, so excited. Thank you again for following along. My name is Izzy Biscus. You can follow me on YouTube as you are here. You can also follow me along on Instagram. I love Instagram. It is one of my favorite things to keep updated. This is only the beginning. This is just the beginning foundation of what is to come. So let's just continue fashion school in London. <laughs> The fact I'm saying that, I, okay, I'm going to go cry real quick. <laughs> I'm not kidding, but <laughs> I will see y'all very shortly. Love y'all. Bye. And I don't want the